Pages is a really simple to use word processor. Shares many of the features that you'll be used to from Microsoft Word or using Google Docs, for example. So, in order to get started, when uh, you just open up Pages on your iPad or uh, any other iOS device, in fact, and you'll be taken then to your iCloud page. Now, this may or may not have different documents in it. In order to create a new document, click on the plus on the top left hand side and then create a document. You can see you've got a range of different templates that you could choose from. I'm just going to go with a black ink one for the purposes of uh, this now. Um, typing on it obviously is as easy as uh, any typing you would do on your iPad. And you can highlight words, you can make text bigger, you can bold, underline, italics, etc. You've got additional formatting up here um, via the paintbrush to, uh, icon here. Now, in order to do other bits and pieces, you can add images through the plus button here. It just goes into your camera roll. Tables can be accessed from here as well, as can charts or any basic shapes that you'd want to include. So this can all be done rather easily through through the menus at the top. Now when you've finished, if you just click on the documents, that will take you back to your iCloud. And you can see that the little arrow just indicates that it's now uploading to the web and syncing with my other devices. Now I can access my iCloud also through any internet browser, just logging onto iCloud and then using your Apple ID to access these documents. And you can download them in a wide variety of formats. Now, so I mentioned you can download those from from the web, or actually from the iPad here, you can just email them from here. And you can choose the format that you want to email them, either as a native pages document or a PDF or Word document there. So great for typing, easy to do, and then great for sharing later on. That's pages for you.